According to World Health Organization, about 28 to 35 percent of people aged 65 years and above experience fall each year. Fall contributes for over 80 percent injury-related hospitalizations of people older than 65 years. This raises a need for distress call systems when elderly experience falls. We propose a fall detection system with a variable detectors that link with a phone app. The wearable detector is mounted on the belt of the user to collect the movement of the data. The movement of the data is obtained using a gyroscope and accelerometer. The collected data will be sent to the phone apps for processing the fall and non-fall recognitions. Whenever there is a fall detected, the phone apps will send an emergency message to the caretakers through the Google Cloud Message service and then all four records are updated in the online database and the database becomes the personal health records for the elderly. There are four important processing stages in these algorithms. The first one is the filtering, the second one is the segmentation and the third one is the feature assertion and the last one is the four classification. The wearable device does not send the movement data to the phone all the time. The connection between the wearable device and the phone is made only when certain thresholds is attained. Using smartphone as the intermediary communication system, our system becomes portable. Hence, the fault detection can work beyond a fixed area. In our system embrace the concept of Internet of Things, IoT, the wearable device itself collects the data and sends the data to Internet for data collections through the smartphone applications and a shared database that has more than one users will actually enable the patterns of fall to be analyzed just to build a statistical modeling of fall events for local or global populations. This data analysis and big data approach will eventually enhance the predictive ability of fall events to be used by healthcare service provider. And this IoT concept shall improve the healthcare system. I think the students are able, or the were able, to plan, execute a very complex project that has commercial values. It's this kind of project that has potential to be admitted into entrepreneurship programs, like the programs conducted through the InnoHub by UPM. This project has a lot of potentials in advancing the technology in humankind applications. By making this device accessible to the public, it will definitely help not only the elderly, but also the caretaker in ensuring a better quality of life.